Good morning guys, welcome to Bentonville, Arkansas. I just flew in here yesterday on my way to Oshkosh and man, this place is awesome. They uh, have an incredible FBO here, just incredible service, really nice people. They don't charge a lot of fees, which is pretty unusual for an FBO. But uh, I'm here in uh, Bentonville, Arkansas, as I said, and I'm about to go explore the Ozarks. So come along. All right guys, we're about to depart Bentonville and head out to the east. Bentonville traffic, white experimental, taking runway 35, Bentonville. Let's go up. It's a pretty day. Looks like I have a, a lake straight ahead. I just departed the Bentonville Municipal Airport and I'm headed west toward Gaston's. Did a little bit of research and looks like it's a really pretty grass strip right on the White River. Tons of fishing, looks like hiking and mountain biking. Got a ton of good information from Fly Oz or Fly OZ. I haven't really talked to anybody to figure out how to pronounce that, but uh, go check out flyoz.com and they have a ton of good information about flying here in the area. Man, this is incredibly beautiful. Got the hills right into the lake. Amazing air airstrips out here. I just flew past the one that was a private airstrip up on a hill tucked into the trees. Got a couple people out on their boats. Just getting to Gaston's right here on the White River. Looks like there's a giant dam over to my left. And I can see the field, I believe. I go do a low pass and see what the winds are doing. And really just get a lay of the land. Gaston's traffic wide experimental two miles to the west. Uh, gonna do a low pass, see what the winds are doing. Gaston. Gaston traffic wide experimental short final. Welcome to Gaston's Resort, right here on the White River. Looks like a big fishing area, hiking, mountain biking. I even saw some kayaks and canoes out on the river.
Dipping the old ugly toes in the freezing cold water. Man, this is refreshing. Well guys, this place certainly does not disappoint. Landed out here at Gaston's Air Park and uh, now I'm taking a little walk along the White River. Appears to be some beautiful trout fishing here. Certainly gonna have to come back. This place is amazing. Just absolutely gorgeous. I can feel the cool breeze coming off the water. Um, be nice to take a dip, but I didn't quite bring my shorts. <laughs> but definitely gonna have to come back here, maybe do some fishing, hiking, mountain biking, bring the family. It's, uh, it's really pretty. All right, guys, nice little pit stop here at Gaston's. Let's uh, head over to Birds, go check out Birds. It's a little bit of a mountaintop landing from what I understand. Let's go uh, check that out. Gaston's traffic, uh, White Highlander departing. Gaston's. Well, folks, this is the White River. Just took off out of Gaston. It's gonna head over to Birds. Thought I'd fly along the river a little bit. Down through the river valley. Oh, gotta look out for power lines. See a couple down low. Is good. The river bends around the direction that I'm going, so I'm just gonna go ahead and kind of follow it around and then take off to the southwest. <laughs> Well guys, I'm cruising along. I actually got the uh, field confused where we're going. We're actually going to Ponca International. I'm cruising along at about 1,600 feet, and it turns out Ponca, you land at 2,300 feet. So, I'm guessing it's these mountains right straight ahead of us. I'll have to climb up a little bit to actually land, if I feel comfortable landing. You're supposed to land on 2-8, which is a bit of an uphill, and then take off on, what is that, 1-0. Uh, so we'll see what the winds are doing. If it's not too crazy, we'll, uh, we'll give it a shot. This is some beautiful country, though. Tons of woods and rivers. Lots of sandbars in the rivers, but I, don't, I haven't seen any that are quite landable. I'm sure there are some around here. Taking a little bit of a detour out of uh, the way of Ponca because there are these cool mountains right here with a little bit of a saddle. Everything looks clear. I don't see any power lines or towers or anything like that. That looks like a nice private piece of property that you could land on. A little bit of an uphill.
Oh, there's Ponca International. Little bit of a tailwind coming in. Looks like the bailout is either left or right. They're coming in uphill. Looks pretty calm. I get stable on the approach. And now it still shifted a little bit of a crosswind. Definitely a different look to landing. Going uphill. <laughs> Next time, I'm going to lock the tailwheel. Hi, atop the Ozarks. Ponca International. What a nice strip. It's perched right up here on top of the mountain. A little bit of an uphill landing. A little bit of a downhill takeoff. So, but man, look at that view. Well, it certainly looks like they could use some rain. Time for me to head back to Bentonville. Just took off out of Ponca International, which I've never landed up on a mountaintop like that. I've never landed on an uphill grade like that. So a lot of a lot of firsts today. Just an unbelievable day. Well, heading back to Bentonville, so I'm gonna sign off and I'll see you guys on the next video.